Hello lovely people, Alyssa here. Do you find yourself killing plants soon after bringing them home? The most common killer in my experience is watering. Here's how you can water right and stop killing your plants. The key mistake is watering too little or too often. Signs of underwatering Crispy leaves are often a sign of underwatering. When was the last time your plant had a drink? Signs of overwatering Yellow, squishy leaves and rotting roots from sitting in soggy soil are a sign of overwatering. Was your plant watered a little too often this time? Here's how you know when to water your plants. Stick your finger into the soil. If it's dry a couple inches down, it may be time to water. Stick a chopstick into the soil. If it comes out dry or clean, it may also be time to water. Use a moisture meter and stick it into the soil. You may wish to water if it reads dry. Feel the weight of your pot. Get used to the weight of your pot when it's dry and when it's wet by picking it up. I find this method convenient, but more suitable for light plastic pots as it's easier to feel the difference in weight with those. You'll usually water when the pot feels lighter than it should be. Observe your plant and touch it. Many plants droop when it's time to water and perk up when they've had enough. For plants like Philodendron, Monstera or Pothos with thicker leaves, you may even feel the leaves get flatter or softer when it's time to water. I use this method most of the time and it works like a charm. Do's and don'ts. Always tip out extra water from the cover pot or tray. Sitting in a wet tray is the perfect recipe for rotting roots. Pro tip, if you overwater, setting your pot on an absorbent paper towel can help draw out excess moisture. Avoid showering the leaves of your plant when watering, unless you absolutely have to. Wet leaves encourage fungal and bacterial diseases. You might wonder, don't plants get rained on in the wild? Well, yes, but it's a case of survival of the fittest out there. Do not spritz just the surface of the soil. Water deeply so that moisture reaches the roots throughout the pot. If you're new to plants, you can set a reminder to check if they need watering. Here's an app called Plant Note that has this reminder function. But you can use anything that works for you. You can keep it simple by getting into the habit of checking your plants on specific days every week. So there's no need for reminders as well. This is what I do personally. These tips are subject to the type of plant you have. Look up your plant's needs first. Now, I hope these tips help you to give your plants the love they deserve. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like and subscribe for more. What are your favorite plant care tips? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching and happy planting. See you next time!